<laughs> they're really good friends, and 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 at a point it was very scary. Don't ever date your band members. I'm just gonna put that out there. But if you have to, hope to God you have great people like this that can get through it. So did you uh, did music bring you together? Yes. And then and then you broke up after I the battle. I was her guitar teacher. <laughs> <laughs> I like to play guitar. Oh, scandalous! You <laughs> get lessons. Ha 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 Okay. Yeah. Wow. Well, and then the band formed, and you broke up. Well, what happened was I had a band called A Girl Named Noah. Yeah, she had a band. And she would come to the shows, and I'm like, well, come up and play a song. We'd get her to play one song, two songs, and the band was like, well, how do I play more? And finally, she learned Join almost the all the music. And I was band. A Girl Named Noah. They snicked me in the same way. Yeah, and we were, we were playing a show out, a girl, a girl Named Noah. We were doing some cover songs and whatnot. Okay. And we're playing. Our lead singer so happened to be sick. We're sitting there trying to fill spots we're all the time. We're all and like, well, I'm singing, she's singing. We and these guys, by the way, are not singers. <laughs> you got fired the next day. And, so, and you so, are dead. Well, she's, I, she's, I, she's, I on the, she's on the side of the stage, and we notice this girl, like, Sing it. And she's singing to every one of the songs, and we're like, Come what's on her up. deal? And we're like, who, yeah, who wants to sing, you but know? I had stage fright horribly, so I was really? just one of those, like, she audience did, singers. Um, Pat Benatar. Yeah, hit me with your best, best shot. shot. Yes. And she got on stage, she started singing. And uh -huh. she, uh -huh. yes. Okay, I didn't even know and, it. Well, they all and fell in love with me. The drummer, like, well, Chris yeah. turned to the drummer and said, "Go get her, go number. Get her number. What's she gonna now? do with this?" And <laughs> just wanted to sing. What's she gonna do with the number? <laughs> she thought so, I was competing for it. <laughs> next, yeah, they were fighting over like the booty call. And I'm like, no, no, uh, that's not it. We well, were her in the band. That, I was with her at right. the time. She's they like, fired <laughs> their old singer and they hired me. And, and that's how you guys were formed. That's an awesome story. That's no, it's great. We all sit in and she was. Awful. Musicians we just had that. chemistry. Yeah. We did. We've Absolutely. always had it. We still have it. So. And then how when, how long ago was that? How long have you been together? 2002, 2003? Yeah. Wow. It's been a while. And so you became friends, and so everyone's just single, and it, that's fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, we, we okay. We dabble in the relationship world, but we like to play. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it makes the band closer. But we went on and off. We all took we all took time for our careers in school and you know random things and um there was like a big pocket missing out of our lives so we decided to get back in. <laughs> back together. Yeah, so we've been, been in it this. for about six months now and it was weird. We like thought we'll do it for fun and we started getting calls from like radio stations and clubs and everything yeah. and it was like people missed us and it was really cool and so I'm we're back well, in it to win it so I'm fans already I haven't even um, heard these girls but oh, good. no what I do here I've seen the video it's good stuff and uh, the only band in the competition so yeah, imagine that right? I would think yeah it doesn't yeah. make sense to me <laughs> it's kind of weird but you know what if this is hip-hop capital of the USA we're at least gonna leave rock on it we're gonna leave our mark <laughs> yeah I am a rock and roller too. I grew up in rock and roll. Yeah, that's yeah, right. right on. <laughs> so yeah, you were gonna say the influences. I don't think I ever heard them. Was it? Uh, I know you each have it's your own. It's all different. Yeah. So, but is what, it mainly rock and roll have? or certain era? Yeah. That. I'm I a 70s up on girl. I love the 70s for some reason. We're flying back know. actually after this to um, open up for Fleetwood Mac, and that's one of my huge influences. I love Fleetwood Mac. I love Pat Benatar. I love Heart. I love. You know, that's yeah. that's me. It's a vocalist. I mean, you just named some powerhouses. Yeah, that's well, great. that's yeah, kind of, that's how I roll. Oh, so. yeah. <laughs> and you got your rap. No, I listen oh. to everything She's from hip hop to rap funk to, to funk yeah. To, um, and you're a guitar teacher. You're yeah. obviously very. She's kind of sick. I listen She's sick. to a lot of different things. Five feet tall and rising. Just very know. talented, right? She shreds. Yeah. yeah. Let's hear something. Oh. Just rip out a soul. Yeah. Come on, just a dun, 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 dun. Let's hear some Zeppelin. You when you're drunk in state Seven. when you're like at like 10%. Just Let's hear some. You always put me on this Let's hear some. Let's hear 10% right now. Right now. Right.
No, I'm going to ask Sorry, you about that. Sorry, just putting that out. Do you feel like yeah, yeah, yeah. that's a very interesting yeah. point you made? Do you think that a lot of lesbians get, you know, caught up in this in this yes. genre that get categorized? Oh, yeah. Yes. No. But I don't. But I don't think they like it though. I think they like something different. Right. <laughs> they they secretly want to rock, but a lot of girls with guitars, girls with guitars. Yep. Get in the acoustic guitar. The Girls guitar with guitars yeah. are fine. The it's guitar with kumbaya shit. I just can't stand right. for it. But I think what happens is that, you know, being a woman in music, it goes back to that whole thing. Being a woman huh. in music, you know. Oh, if you're gay and, and you play music and you're a female, then you must sound like this. Yes. Indigo Girls. Thank you. And they're great. We all grew up on them and we love them and we respect them, but we want to fucking bring Robert Plant to this shit. We want to show people that, like, Women can rock. They can. They can rock. Yeah, definitely. You know? Dory wants to do that. Yeah. <laughs> How long is your uh, set? Do, do we have two songs. That's it. Two songs. Oh, that's it. Oh, but and if then you win the competition. And three songs. So. Here it is. Someday Souvenir. MySpace.com uh, slash Someday Souvenir. Correct. I have probably imagined. Yeah. So uh, check these girls out. You're going to see some live footage of them right about now. And let me get to our first act here. It's called Someday Souvenir. <laughs> Yeah, and they're going to play, so pay attention. Because we're all the way from Tampa, and we came here just for you to show you how the girls like it down in the south. <laughs> Song's our new single, you might hear it on the radio, it's called Shade of Grey, and it's a song that uh, got us here. Thanks to all you guys for voting, we really appreciate it.
city's on fire, they're still my favorite. Shame.